the boy next door. Gobble me, swallow me, trip down the side of me, quick yeah. jump out for you. My beloved cat Ryan recently passed away. I'm so sorry. Uh, thank you, thank you. Um, and uh, uh, before he was sick, like any uh, normal couple in Los Angeles, my, boyf my boyfriend and I uh, consulted a pet psychic, you know, <laughs> just to make sure he didn't have any unfinished cat business. Right? So this is before he, so he was sick. You just yeah, just to make sure he didn't have any like final wishes, like you know, before before he went on. You know, uh, you don't do that. No, yeah, 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 no, people do that, yeah, 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 no, it's oh, okay. well, um, yeah. she had no idea who I was, no idea uh, who I was, that, that, anything about me, she kept calling me ma'am over the phone, which, you know, <laughs> um, and uh, so I'm getting, like, I'm getting emotional, thinking, like, my voice is, like, soothing my cat, and it's, like, his last hours. It's beautiful. Yeah, and the psychic says, yeah, he hates your voice. She says, if you, if you want him to die in peace, he's asking you to shut up. <laughs> shut up! So this is me talking normally. Of course, if I wanted to, you know, uh, try to uh, sub sub sustain the curse, I could talk down here if I wanted to. But that's just that's just so much. <laughs> that's just so much effort that, that I mean, I mean, and I literally like like people still call me ma'am on the phone. Like I remember like, like going through drive-throughs was always fun because it's always so shocking when they'd see me. So it just become like, uh, thank you, ma'am. Whoa. <laughs> Gotta be. Kid, okay, kids make fun of me for my voice. I remember, like, what, what right? I mean, <laughs> it's, not, it's not like I can help it. It's just, and especially when I get excited or nervous, like, I get really high pitched, and then dogs just go crazy. Um, <laughs> but, um, no, I remember one time I was coming out of a, a restaurant, and um, there's this, this little girl in, like, in a princess dress, and I said, Oh, look how cute you are in a princess dress! <laughs> And she looks at me and she's like, You sound like a girl. Yes, yes. Well, my, my parents named him Bob Marley Merlot because he likes the wine. <laughs> the dog does? The dog loves wine. Not yes. your parents. No. <laughs> yeah. They have a huge dinner with all the 100 people are there. Yes, huge, huge, huge. You, did you go to that? I did, yes. Oh, oh yeah, I wouldn't miss that. Yeah, free food and all that. Yeah, it's great. <laughs> um, it, just, it just came. Like, I got bit by the Oprah bug. It just, like, I, I was, like, watching it, and then suddenly I, I hooked. She said something about being, you know, having a full circle moment, and I'm like, that's so me. Um, 50. Oh, no. Okay, okay. Yeah. Uh -uh. I can't make you love me? No, close. Uh, this is how you love me? I don't want to do uh, that. Oh, my God. Hey, wait, wait, wait. I embarrass myself so much in front of celebrities, it's not even funny. Like, I don't know what it is, but like whenever I see somebody that I, you know, grew up watching or that I have, you know, great respect for, I just, I turn into an idiot. I saw Helena Bonham Carter on the red carpet. And I'm a huge, huge fan of, of Helena's, and I've seen every movie she's ever been in, um, every Tim Burton, you know, every Harry Potter, everything she's been in. And, because she's like one of the only people that I was looking forward to seeing at the Golden Globes. And I saw her within like the first five minutes of being on the red carpet. And I turn, and she was right there, and I was not expecting her to be right there. And she goes, oh, hello. And I go, ah! And then that's all I said to her. That was my experience. She's very intimidating because she was like wearing like a theme park, you know, like a big like Ferris wheel and, and like a little like train with people on it. And, um, and I, I didn't know what to call her. I mean, what do you call Lady Gaga? Is it Lady? Is it Gaga? Is it one Gaga? Is it two guys? I mean, is Gaga for short? I mean, is it Gaggy? Is it a nickname? You, you never know. Um, but but she, she answered it because she reached her hand out and said, Hi, I'm Gaga. And I said, I can see that. I mean, I, mean, I know. I, I know yeah, who you yeah. are. Right. Um, and then for whatever reason, I, I bowed. <laughs> Maybe I thought she was royalty at the time because right, she's right. a lady and she'd have a crown uh -huh. type thing on. Um, um, and I just got really close to her, like uncomfortably close to her, and I said, I just want to let you know, nobody has talent but you. None of the new artists. Uh, <laughs> and then I wouldn't let go for, for like a good, like, you know, 15 minutes. Um, and then I just, I just ran out because I was uh -huh. so embarrassed. Oh. Great! <laughs> That's a hate crime. There was a little girl, a very, very pretty little girl who came up and, and spoke dolphin to me. Dolphin. Yes, she, she spoke in dolphin, but but I, I didn't know what she was saying. Um, but I think she was disappointed that I didn't speak dolphin as well. She came up to you and she just started making dolphin yeah, yes, noises at yes. you. Can, can you give us it, an it example? Was, of what? Well, I'm not a pro, but it was something like. Eh, 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 eh. Oh, do you currently have or have you ever had any nicknames? No. 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 That's what she thinks. Hey. I, I have to apologize to you. Okay, what happened? I just broke a lamp in your dressing room. You're joking. I did. I, I, was, I was saying hi to Molly, and I thought I was going back on what I thought was the chair, but it was a table with a lamp on it, with an <laughs> antique lamp on you it. And I promise I was not like, I was not like reenacting. <laughs> oh, oops. Oh, did I do that? Just if I did that, then okay. Stop oh, 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 gosh. This is why I'm never invited anywhere. <laughs>
But as soon as Betty White sat next to my grandmother, she leans over and she goes, Hi, Betty. <laughs> I'm Christopher's grandma. <laughs> and Betty just kind of, you know, like made a grandma noise and nodded. And what, what, what's, it. what's a grandma noise? Like, like, oh. <laughs> Tune in to the next episode of Glee. <laughs> Get it? Get it? Get it? Because it, it's Michael Jackson. And, and he says, hee hee. But I, I, I changed it to glee hee. <laughs> Actually, because at least I'm on it. I told Bill, ask for a car while you ride that dick. You really ain't never got a fucking for a thing.